Hi, everyone. This is going to be a really short video, but it, it is breaking news, and I want to make sure that everybody knows this. Basically, recently, and I'm not going to mention any names here, but you probably know who I'm talking about. There's been a couple of people that were spreading rumors that there was a family intervention and that the Fenn family forced Forrest to stop the chase and and so on and so forth. And, and uh, Sheila Old in here actually showed up in a recent video by one of those YouTubers. And this was verified by them to be him. And basically, he set the record straight. Basically, he came out and he told them that all your information is false. It's wrong. He debunked it all. So next time, you might want to think about where you get your information from, because clearly um, the people that were saying that they had proof that there's family intervention, and of course, they never offered any sources up, and it was always hearsay, and it was always, you know, somebody that was known to be around Forrest Fenn. Somehow, because they were around Forrest Fenn, you're supposed to believe them. And I really thought that this is funny, because the reality is that you should not trust those people. They're not telling you the truth. Um, they're trying to draw attention to their YouTube channel and make money basically off of other searchers using content that they drum up as controversies. They're always negative. They're never trying to really do anything productive like solve the poem. So I'm really, I'm really glad. I want to thank Shilo for setting us straight. So again, this is from Sheila Old, and Sheila Old is Forrest Fenn's grandson. And basically, he came in here, and their video was about they were breaking news that they had, in, you know, internal proof that there was some kind of an intervention that happened in 2018, and the family told Forrest that basically you're going to, you know, call an end to this, or we're going to announce it as a hoax the day after you die, and and all this other really, really wacky information that I couldn't believe that I heard it. You know, quite honestly, um, I'm surprised that the Femme family didn't get really annoyed and actually try to take them to court because it's pretty demeaning and, you know, uh, information to put out there when it, it has no fact behind it at all. So really, I, I, I suggest you guys pay attention to the sites that you're going to because, you know, you're being fed a bunch of lies. And this proves it. So consider where you go and where you spend your time. Try to focus on other YouTube channels that, and I'm not just talking about mine. Focus, there's plenty of people out there. And I got to mention um, Paul Paul from the UK, Rodney Green. There, there's just too many of them to mention. So focus more on those people and less on the people that are trying to create drama. Don't pay attention to the other sites. They've been misleading you all along. And finally, people are now going to see this. And that's why I'm putting this out there. Normally, I don't want to get involved in any of this controversy. I've, I've, in fact, if you look at my other videos, I talk highly about most of these other places that I'm talking about. So, because I really didn't want to get involved in it. But, but when I heard that, st that, that stuff yesterday about interventions, and I mean, this is just going way, way above and beyond reality i mean i think people are really seriously delusional at this point um and apparently those same people also verify that this is in fact chilo and it's funny because if you listen to their comments it went completely right over their head that although he didn't really talk negative about them he basically just was telling them and you know just all right knock it off you know we've heard enough of this stuff it's all debunked it's all false and I don't care who you got the information from. You know, it's wrong. Anyway, that's it. Y'all have a great week. Peace.